Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. For some reason I couldn't post the video yesterday. I will still try to maybe put the clips together from today. This is Sunday the 12th. Where I am is this square with the clowns, a clown world. And behind me is the circus, I believe. And what I will do to you, what I will do for you, <laughs> not to you, today I will read to you what I was actually reading yesterday, but for some reason I couldn't post this video. Um, and I will break down this information in a few clips, so maybe that will help, uh, it will help with downloading this. It's quite important information from Poland. Uh, the first article is from Rzeczpospolita PL. And it says 24 hours to pack up and show up for the army. From 2 to 16 days, short-term exercises of reservists are to last. They can count on compensation for the lost wages and civilian life. This is the result of the draft regulation of the Minister of National Defense, Błaszczak, on military exercises of passive reserve soldiers. The project went into negotiations. The need to issue it results from the Act on Defense of the Homeland Journal of Laws 2020-20 item 2305. The draft defines, among other things, the duration and type of military exercises of passive reserve soldiers. Passive reserve soldiers will be able to be called up for exercises involving participation in combating natural disasters or search and life-saving operations. The decision in this regard is to be delivered to the interested party at least 24 hours before the scheduled date of appearance. In the second part, the Ministry of National Defense has published a new version of the draft regulation on military qualifications in 2023. The start day has been changed and extended in time. It was decided due to a collision with the Matura exams. What are Matura exams are the exams uh, when you finish high school in Poland, you take those exams and uh, you're, I think, 18, 19 years old when this happens. So. The 2023 military qualifications in Poland will be extended to 66 working days. It will start later than originally planned. The first commission will start their work just after Easter. In 2023 alone, about 230,000 people are to appear before medical commission. On April 17 this year, military qualifications will begin. It will end on July 21st. During this period, uh, who will be called? I have a few points here. I'm not gonna read this entire article for you. This one is actually from a different portal. So who will be called to those uh, commissions? Men born in 2004, which is 19 years old. Men born between 1999 and 2003 who do not have a specific category of fitness for active military service. And one more point I have, there is more, but I will read to you those three. Women born in the years 1999 to 2004 who are holding qualifications useful for military service. Um, I would like you to look it up yourself and see. This is what's going to happen. Each commission must examine 30 people per day. This is what's happening uh, in Poland. Planned for spring this year. One officially first transaction with my cart at the grocery store right behind me. You can see Spark right there. Yeah, can't run too. Got myself meat and stuff. All good.
American Embassy, everyone. I don't think I can record, but what the heck. There we go. Right here, and there is another building on the corner to the left. Sometimes you have to challenge yourself. Long walk, I was freezing, but I made it. I'm in this shopping center, just had coffee there. Beautiful shopping center. I will make another clip to show you. Uh, and yeah, it's good to have some little challenges that you can overcome. I could take metro, but you know what? When you walk, you actually see a lot of things really don't like shopping centers I don't like energy in them but for some reason this one doesn't irritate me I had to have coffee and warm up a little so and I don't think I can record much here because there is music playing so let's try to do it outside Guys, the score of my walk at this point is 19,000 steps, which is a little bit over nine miles, and it's not over yet. But you know how good it feels when you walk like this? It's very good, and for your brain, for your mental, for your body. And besides that, you can see a lot of places which you will not be able to see if you are underground. I will go underground, but. It's great weather, as you can see, not much snow at all, just in the parks, so why not to take advantage of it, right? let's talk this wasn't cheap wasn't like very very expensive but the place I was just in incredible food I think I had like one of the ba best waiters ever his name was Eugene Eugene I think you say Eugene or Eugeni we say in Polish guys Bottega, La Bottega Siciliana someone of you recommended a place for me because of the espresso Everything was fantastic. Service, top-notch. I'm literally falling in love with Russian dining uh, and restaurants. I'm telling you, incredible place. It's very close to the Red Square. So I will end this video here. And as always, quick reminder, please join me on Locals, follow me on Instagram, join my mailing list, and you'll find all the links down below this video. I hope I can download this tonight. And I will see you tomorrow on Sunday, the 12th of February, during my life at 4 p.m. Moscow time. Das Vidanie, everybody!